Now, this next example, kind of long. I have a few operations I can perform to this. But remember, we have to stick with the order. So I'm just going to write PEMDAS, PEMDAS, so I can see the order. OK, so always, always parentheses first, right? I have a parentheses right here. So I'm going to write everything else out. Solve the parentheses out. 5 minus 2 is 3. So that's 3 squared divided by 9. Now here, what's my next operation? Exponents. So since I have an exponent right here, I'd have to solve this out before I do anything else. So this is going to be 6 times this, remember, is 3 times 3. 3 squared is the same thing as 3 times 3. And 3 times 3 we know is 9. And then divided by 9. So I'm just rewriting this out. Okay. Then multiplication and division right here. Um, and the, when we have only these two, they're actually going to be the same. They're, they're, there's no order for multiplication and division. Okay, so you're just going to solve out um, whichever comes first when it comes to multiplying and dividing. And for this problem, it just happens to be a multiplication. So uh, we're just going to solve this out. 6 times 9 is 54. 54 divided by 9. Okay, so I'm just rewriting this. 54 divided by 9 is... 6. So my answer to this, 6 times 5 minus 2 squared divided by 9, as long as you follow the order of operations, your answer will be 6. Okay? So that's it for this lesson on order of operations. Thank you for watching educator.com.